everyone, and welcome to Know Your PC. I'm Malou. And I am Bob. And we're here to help you with some tips on using your HP TouchSmart PC on finding your system information. That's right. But first, before that, alert everyone, alert! <laughs> uh, it has come to our attention that uh, sometimes people are finding that their computer is not working correctly, all right? And one of the things that it could possibly be is it's not getting enough air, all right? It's getting Which, hot. It's getting too hot to handle, too cold to hold. All right, so down here are vents, all right? I'm going to show them to the cameras a little bit easier like that. And also at the top, right show here. the... Thank you. If you don't let your computer breathe, it will have a hard time operating, and it might shut down even. So. Don't have any shelves or picture books. frames, books, anything around there because it'll prevent it from breathing, all right? All right, so all now, right. some tips in finding your system information. Let's yes. say that the power is even off on your computer, right? Okay. One way to find your system information is right here on the back with this connector panel. Okay. Take that off right here. Thank you so much for your help. You're welcome. Right there on the bottom, you will notice that there is the model number and your serial number if you need that information, if you ever call the help and support a line, okay? That's right. All right, so I'll bring this back around. All right, that's one way. That's one way. Thank All right. you. All right, the other way that you can find your system information is from your keyboard. All you need to do is press Control, Alt, and S as in support at the same time. And there you can see your system information will show up there with a the model number product number, serial number, everything you need. S is for support. There you go. All right. Now, there are a couple other ways to find out specs and more information about your computer. I'm going to show you by canceling out the X here. And then I'm going to go to help and support, double tap on the blue question mark. And up will come this menu, and you will touch troubleshooting tools once, system information at the top once, and then go touch here to open system information. Oh, yes, continue, please. It's asking for permission. <laughs> and so now it's thinking about it's gathering all the different specs and things about the computer, uh, hardware, software, all the different things you might know if you or want to know if you need to upgrade or do anything else to the computer. Here we go. Everything's there. It's all right here. Awesome. So you can scroll down and see a tons and tons of great information about your computer. One thing that I will mention is under operating system, it, you will notice that it's the Vista Premium Edition 64. Now that means 64 bit. Now, most of these will come out with 64. There might be some that come with 32. You just need to make sure because when you're updating different softwares and programs, it'll ask if you have a 32 or 64. You want to choose the appropriate one, and this is where you find out. Common all question. Right? 64 bit. That's right. So we will X out of this. Oh, are you sure? Yes, I'm sure, but thanks for checking. One more place that I'm going to show you how to find out more specs about your computer. Go online. I'm double clicking on the Internet Explorer, and then I am going to, would you highlight that up there for me, please? There you go. I'm going to hp.com slash support. Here we go. Now I'm going to choose the region that we're in. We happen to be in Northern America, so we're going to choose that. And United States English, so we're clicking United States. And then it's going to ask for your product, OK? We are using the IQ 507, and so I'll put that in there. And you're going to ask for product information. And then we're going to go to product specifications, AKA specs. All right, and so that's how you find different specifications on the computer. And remember, if you'd like more information, you can always log on to the website at hp.com slash touchsmart. That's right. If you want to email us, let us know how we're doing, any questions, comments, knowyourpc at hp.com. All right, so thanks very much for watching. I'm Malou. And I'm Bob.